Forest West Side Flower Shop. I'm about to get in drip. What's up, you guys? It's your boy V from Westside Flower Shop, and we are back with a another video. First and foremost, I'd like to say thank you to everybody that liked and that comment on my last video. If you guys have not seen that video, a little ticket will be above my head, so you guys can check that video out. But today, we have to jump into two things. I'm talking the week four of Supreme, the historic Glamour collab. We have some leaked news about a box <laughs> logo dropping what? soon. And I have a sneaker review, sneaker unboxing. I'm not gonna tell y'all what it is or what colorway it is, but I got some heat to show y'all. So without further ado, make sure you guys go and follow me on Instagram. I do all my women, gemming, selling. What did he say? Over there. So I greatly appreciate it if you guys go and follow me over there. Also, I have a brand new TikTok that I try to stay consistent as much as I can on y'all. You know what I'm saying? But I have some pretty entertaining stuff over there. Make sure you guys throw that a follow. Make sure you guys go and drop a comment. Make sure you guys drop a like. Make sure you guys hit subscribe. Y'all already know how I'm coming. Y'all already know how I'm going, man. But I'm not going to hold you guys down with a big old intro. So here we go. Alrighty guys, so we're gonna jump right into this week four drop list. We have the overdyed beanie. Um, I love all these colors of the beanie. My favorites are the blue, the yellow, the black, um, literally all of them. All of them are so fire. I think these are going to resell. Um, they won't resell real good at first, but the local sales will probably be the best on this one right here. Um, the splatter spring summer top. Um, I really do like the graphic on this, but I know this shirt's gonna be super expensive. I think only personal for this one right here. Um, we can keep going. The embroidered S hooded sweatshirt. Um, I don't like the different colors uh, with the S logo on this. Um, I really like that pink one. I really think the pink one's gonna go first out of all of these, um, just because it's the cleanest colorway. Uh, let's see. We have the reflective zip hooded jacket. I'm not a big fan of this. Uh, the little Supreme hit down here is pretty cool. Supreme by the hood. And then, And then the Supreme all the way around. I can see it's a zip. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that on the screen, but it's a zipper all the way around. So, I mean, it is what it is. It's not like the craziest jacket in the world, but I definitely like it somewhat. I don't think it's going to resell or anything, but it's not too ugly. The next thing we have is a split logo pullover. Um, it gives me really early 2000s vibe, like something like FUBU or Inichi would have done back in the day. Um, I'm not a big fan of this sweater though. Don't think it'll resell or anything like that, but I wouldn't personally it either. So, I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna keep going. The reflective track pants is just like the reflective zip hoodie. The historic glamour snake denim trucker jacket though. Sheesh. Like this jacket right here is absolutely insane, man. I love the little frayed edges on the collar. I love the little Supreme branding hit back here. Just a beautiful jacket, man. I It's getting a little hot for jackets, so I don't think it'll like resell first day, but this black colorway is insane. This white colorway is really cool. Um, I think the white I sell out first just because it has all those colors on it. Um, I think all of these are fire, man. And I love the matching pants with this. Let me go back. Uh, the matching pants with these are, come on, man. These are absolutely insane. Um, it really, and they're double knee too. I didn't even know they were double knee. Um, this is, this is hard, bro. This is hard. I'm not a big fan of white pants. Um, but these are definitely tough, bro. These are definitely tough. These go crazy. So we're gonna keep going. We have the Supreme Hysteric Glamour logo zip-up sweater. Um, I don't wanna get flagged, but that's that. I don't really like it. Um, that's why it's so downvoted, it's kinda ugly. Um, we have the overdyed camo camp cap. 
you know, it's a camp cup. I don't think they're going to do very well. Um, probably local they will, but not really. Um, the historic glamour plaid flannel, though. Yeah, these are... It just takes a certain person to rock these. Honestly, I, I like them for personal. Um, I don't think they're going to do... Wait, hold on. Woo! Woo! Eat! Heat. This is kind of tight. This is kind of tight. I really like the uh, the back hit. It looks like it's all embroidered too. Um, this will probably be a hold. Like I would wait on something like this to go up as far as resale. But don't listen to these down folks. This this is fire. Um, we're gonna keep going. The the snake crusher though. Sheesh. Pressures are coming back in style, so I really do think these will do good. Um, something for personal, something to hold for resale. Um, we have, I haven't seen these yet. So the Supreme Historic Glamour Lunchbox set. Yeah. Yeah, these are fire. Um, I don't think they'll necessarily resale, um, but these are definitely a fire personal. Um, definitely a good hold. If you could hold them. I really like this. Uh, I like all the colors. These are definitely fire. So next we have the Historic Glamour Supreme Crew Neck. Uh, these crew necks. I haven't seen them yet. Um, they're kind of goofy. They're kind of goofy looking. This leopard print or whatever. I'm not. That is crazy. Gray one is nice. The pink one is cool. Um, the black one is always going to sell. But... I don't think these are gonna do very well. All right, next we have the embroidered S sweatshirt. Um, just like the sweatshirt, I'm not a fan of these. I honestly like the pink color out of all of them. The S looks better on a pair of shorts than it does on a hoodie. It seems kind of awkwardly placed on the hoodie like they didn't really even know where to put it. Um, but it is what it is. Next we have the Historic Glamour Zip Up Hooded Sweatshirt. Uh, this one's pretty cool. This one's super cool. I don't know who that lady is, but that's a really cool graphic to me. Um, it seems like the gold on the back of these hoodies is like, I wouldn't say 3D, but something you can, like you could feel the texture of it. That's, that's pretty cool. I'm not a big fan of zip up hoodies though. I do think it, uh, I think it'll do well down the line. I think this collab in general will do well down the line, but that's not something I would pick up. Next, we have the Supreme Historic Glamour Blurred Girls Rayon shirt. Um, I don't know what this is, and the graphics sounds like it's going to be bad, so I'm just going to click off of that. Uh, <laughs> the Velour tracksuit um, is kind of cool. Like I said, these graphics are kind of crazy, so I can't show you all of them. Um, they have a compass six panel. This one's all right. It seems like something like that would have really popped off 2014, 2013, but nobody's trying to rock that stuff now. We have a velour short in the Historic Glamour Supreme. Um, I think these are pretty cool. Like, I don't, I wouldn't wear velour shorts, but yeah, these are actually pretty cool. Um, I like the black colorway. Let me go back on there. I like the black colorway a lot. The red one's cool. The green one is probably my least favorite. Um, and then we have the leopard trench. Um, like I said, this graphic is crazy, so I'm not trying to get flagged. Um, I wouldn't wear this. I think it's pretty ugly. Honestly, if I was to give a rating to this entire collab or this entire week, I would honestly give it like an eight and a half. Um, I think one of the best items to go for are the overdive beanie, the trucker jacket, the double knee carpenter pants, um, the lunchbox set, the sweat short, because it's going to get hot outside, and that's it. <laughs> Alright you guys, so now we have to jump into this unboxing. I told you guys on my Instagram that I hit on these shoes, and I'm going to be quiet, I'm going just, to I'm just show y'all, I'm going to just show y'all. Bam! If you know this box, then you know what is inside of here. I can show you guys the size tag. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. These is 
clean. The shoe I have in my hand is going to be a grail for years and years to come. I am talking about the BAM Supreme Dunk Lows in this blue colorway is my personal favorite. These are absolutely fire. I love, 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 love the lace lock on these. Um, the OG stars on it. The quality is so, so fire on this shoe. Um, I'm absolutely in love with this thing. If you look at the insides, the insides spell out Supreme. I don't know if you can see that on the on the screen, but the insides spell out Supreme. These are my favorite shoes that I own right now. Um, if you look, the prices are honestly holding for all the pairs. Um, I don't think they're gonna go down anytime soon. This is a grail shoe. This is a grail shoe and I'm so happy to have this shoe. Um, people have asked me if, I, if I'm gonna sell, if I'm gonna keep, I do not know just yet, but these right here, if they gotta go on foot at least once. At least once these gotta go on foot. But I just wanna give you guys a detailed look at this shoe. This shoe is absolutely crazy. They have the gold hit, of the gold Nike hit right there. Um, you can't really see it on the screen because it's shiny, but uh, that's so crazy, man. So crazy. I love this shoe a lot. They also come with blue laces, which I don't know why Supreme put my laces tied into my other laces, but that's how it is. Um, I really love this shoe, man. I really love this shoe. I have not tried this shoe on. This shoe is completely DS, um, but I love these things. I love these things. These are... These are my prized possessions right here. Alrighty guys, thank you for watching this entire video. That is it. Um, make sure you guys go and follow my Instagram. I do all of my updates on there. Make sure you guys go follow my brand new TikTok. Make sure you guys drop a comment, drop a like, hit subscribe, hit the post notification bell. Y'all already know all the YouTube things I got to say, but we're gonna try something different. Make sure you guys go and drop a comment and tell me what you guys like from this week. I definitely think there's some heavy hitters as far as resale, as far as stuff for personal. I'm gonna get busy this week. If you guys wanna see a live cop from me, I've never done one on this channel, but I'm starting to get my screen recordings right, y'all. So if y'all wanna see that, make sure you guys go and let me know in the comments. It's been your boy V, Westside Flower Shop, and we are out. Girls, Westside Flower Shop, I'm about to get drip. Spend about a hundred thousand dollars on my fit, and I know.